from Penn State, from the Raiders, etc. Yeah, it was definitely a faster pace of the game. Um, we, we need to improve a little bit by, on uh, getting in and out of the huddle. I thought we broke the huddle a lot today with not enough time to do what we wanted to do at the line of scrimmage. Um, so that's something we're definitely going to look to improve on this week as we prep for D.C. now. Um, but in terms of the atmosphere, it was fantastic for, for week one. Um, and uh, I thought the fans were loud out there, excited. And, uh, you know, we're going to need that type of energy from them every week. Hey, Matt, congratulations on the white piece. I'm sorry, pro football is not working. Could you take us through some of the faith that you had in some of your receivers, you know, putting the ball, 50-50 ball earlier in the game, the kid came down with a great catch. And uh, same thing with the touchdown with Pearson. Could you take us through that faith you have in them and just the rapport you've developed with them? Yeah, I, I mean, you know, anytime you get one-on-one, -on -one, things like that, and the, like I said, some of the talent we have a wide receiver because I'm extremely sure sure comfortable with giving those guys chances to go up and make plays, giving those guys opportunities, and they've shown that. You know, throughout mini camp in December and throughout throughout training camp in uh, in January, you know, and it's it's a trust factor, and, and and trust is earned. Every single one of those guys out there today have, have earned my trust. You know, I know they're gonna go out there and make plays, do what's right, um, and uh, but but like I like I started off saying, there's there's just some few things miscommunication wise we we have to clean up.